welcome back to a new video simple short video today just uh, gonna show you a quick easy way how to install the Zeebo mod for X-Plane 11 so all the links that uh, you guys are gonna need are gonna be down below in the description so go ahead and down there uh, first link is to the forum of the Zeebo mod for the 737 okay It'll take you to this page of the forum. All these steps I'm going to show you. All right, but at any moment you get lost, these are the steps. They're extremely easy. We're going to want to go to the download link, which is the drive page, which I already have here. Go there, you scroll all the way down to the full version all right so we're at the uh, 3.40 full version download this I already have it downloaded click on download all right next before you do anything there go to the latest version right these are all hot fixes you don't need to install each every single one you go to the latest one which will be here at the top left you click download you right you right click on it and you click download download anyway save it all right and I have it here so full version have it here what you want to do unzip it all right you don't have to but it's better if you do so once you have unzipped it right click here copy all right or you want to go to your explain folder once you're at your X-Plane folder, you go to Aircraft and you see I already have it here. You paste it here. You don't go into Laminar Research. You don't go to Extra Aircraft. You know, paste it here, okay? Once you have it pasted, we're going to install or uh, copy the uh, latest version. Or hotfix, which is all uh, the 3.40.27. Gonna copy all of this. Copy. Go to back to our explain folder, aircraft folder, and then we left click on the 737. We can go ahead and paste everything. All right, overwrite everything. And bam, all right, you have the X-Plane uh, Zebo mod installed. And it's that easy. There's, there's nothing uh, complicated about it. Now, requirements that you're going to need for the Zebo mod. Let's get to this. Why you need to watch the whole video, guys. You're going to need the Avitab plugin. Very simple. You download it. All these links are going to be provided in the description. We're going to start with the Avitab. Right click, copy it. We're going to go back to our explain uh, folder. Go to explain. We're going to go resources, down to plugins, and we paste it here. I already have it here. Okay, Avitab is there. Now we're gonna, we need the terrain radar this for your navigation display. Once again, this uh, will be provided in the link, in the description, excuse me. The link will be provided in this description area down below. Download for x 11. Save. We'll open it. Copy. Go back to your X-Plane folder. Oh, sorry. Same thing, right? Go in the X-Plane folder. Click the resources folder. Plugins. And we already have it here. And yeah, we should. Oh, no. Okay, well, we'll just head paste it. The rain radar is there. We're good to go. There is nothing else to do. Everything's correct. You go to your explain, start it up, select the 737 Zebo mod, and start your uh, flight. All right, things that can happen. 
All right, I couldn't find, let's see this one, for example. All right, from time to time, you could download a hotfix or a full uh, Zebo update. It's gonna say, download exceeded. You're gonna right click, you're gonna make a copy. You're gonna show that file collection and you'll have it here in your files. Here you press download and you'll be able to download it no problem. Okay guys, that's it for this video. Uh, remember to comment, like, and subscribe. I'll be uh, uploading more videos, uh, how-tos and uh, tutorials. So remember to subscribe to get the next videos and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.